Hi, I'm Zebediah from Israeli News Team V, and I'm here at the prison where Joseph was held. Now, uh, I hear that he had some pretty great dreams. Uh, can you elaborate on some of them? No? How about you? Um, I don't really know about them. Don't really know about them? Are they just that fantastic? Yes. Okay. Um, and, sir, uh, what were you put into prison for? Robbing a bank. Robbing a bank. Okay. Well, now, because, uh, let me tell you, the stench is pretty amazing. So, uh, I'll, uh, get you all later. So, bye. Bye, everybody. So, <laughs> Money for bail. Uh, this has been Zebediah from Israeli News Team V. I'll catch you later. Bye. Hi, I'm Zebediah from Israeli News Team 5, and I'm here with Mr. Farrow himself. Mr. Farrow, it's an honor to be in your presence. Thank you. All right. Now, I've come all this way, all the way from uh, Israel, the land of Canaan, to uh, following Joseph and his story. Um, I've been to Pontifer, your uh, advisor's house. I've been to jail. Um, I escaped jail, in a way. Um, and I'm just wondering, why did you bring Joseph into your service? I was having some crazy dreams. And I heard that Joseph had a way with interpreting the dreams, so I just seemed like he was pretty good. So. Really? Well, I had heard a little bit about Joseph and his dreams before, but I didn't know he was that skilled at it. All I really know him from was uh, his amazing coat. Uh, have you heard about this coat? I've heard it's even more splendid than your clothes. Or, no, not, not really. I mean, it's like, not nearly that... Splendid? No, it's, it, you have way more. You're very shiny, so I love this. It's quite sparkly. Yes, um, very merry fellow here. The, the good heart, you know, can take, understand the joke. Anyway, um, so you think Joseph can help you out uh, as, you know, dream person? Yes, he's already been interpreting a couple of my dreams. That's private matter. It's not your business, but to me already. Okay, well, I was just wondering if I could talk to Joseph, you know, I've been kind of searching halfway across, you know, the ancient world trying to find him, so... No. Come on, Pharaoh. Sir, your majesty. No. Lord Almighty. No. Please. Guards! No, no, please. Just, Guards! Just me, Security! Just... Guards! But, security! Mean, no, no, we don't need security. Come here no, and nothing. escort this man out. No, we don't need that. It's okay. It's okay. Oh my gosh, he is a very large man. No, out of no, my please. castle! Come on! Ah, this is Zebediah. Someone's really new to fight. Ah! On yonder. Oh I'm Zebediah from Israeli News Team V, and I'm here with the tribes of Israel as they venture into Egypt. Now, can somebody please tell me why you're moving into Egypt, okay? There was a famine. Okay, what's a famine? We have no food. There's just no food. No There's food? There's no food. Wow. We're all, we're all food. poor. And water. And Nobody we're mentioned poor. Oh my and gosh. Hungry, so we're coming to Egypt. That sounds terrible. I can personally not imagine the struggle these people go through. Because I have plenty of food to spare, and it's like, wow, lots of it. Alright, so what do you guys um, expect, how do you guys expect to find help in Egypt? Do you just 
Uh, what's we're, your plan once you arrive? We well, we're just going to look for people and see if they can give us food because we're all at food right now. We you want just, to find the pharaoh. You're going to find the pharaoh? Yes, we because we know he's that he's rich. He's, well, he's, he's, he's yeah. rich and he's going to give us some food, hopefully. Okay, so you guys are going to go to pharaoh now. Let me tell you, I've had my own run-in with Pharaoh, and uh, he's kind of a rough guy, so um, just watch your step. All right, now I'm going to go back to my nice air-conditioned trailer and uh, have a plate of Jimmy John's. So uh, you all continue on your journey. Uh, meet you there in about a week. Jimmy I'm going to take a bus, and yeah. All right, this is Zebediah from Israeli News CMV, and I'm out of here. See ya. Hi, Zebediah here from Israeli News Team B, and I'm here with some uh, young, some young ones, you know, and they're here learning about the story that we've been covering um, the past uh, few days. So, do you guys know who Joseph is? Yes. Yes, you do. Who's Joseph? Does he have a coat? Yes. 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 What I'm, color? I'm one. Like a rainbow coat? Uh -huh. Man, that must look very pretty. Does Joseph uh, have any brothers? Yes. yes. Yes, he does. Are they nice brothers? Yeah. No. Yes or no? Are they nice? No. No? No. no. Why are they not nice to Joseph? Because mm -hmm. they want the coat. Because they want the coat? Yeah, and they were whipping out Paul and, and they, put, they put in blood. And they put blood on it? Mm. Well, well, if Joseph's not wearing the coat, where's Joseph? In a tunnel. In a tunnel? Like a yeah. well? Joseph's in a, Joseph's in a well? Yeah. Oh my god. And he was sold. And he was sold? Sold to where? Sold to who? <laughs> sold to Egypt. Sold to Egypt? Wow, that's incredible. Yeah, what do you think about Joseph? Do you think he's going to be saved? Do you think it's going to be okay in the end? Do you think the story of Joseph's going to turn out well? Cool. Well, I'm sure you guys are going to learn more about it as the week goes on. Um, what's your favorite part about Vacation Bible School? Um, playing. Playing? What's your favorite part? Playing. Playing? What's your favorite part? Playing. Playing? What's your favorite part? Learning. Learning? Oh, good nice. job. Nice. Way to change it up. All right. But you also like the playing, don't you? Yeah, we all <laughs> like the playing. I like the playing, too. Awesome. Well, thank you all for uh, taking part in this interview. I hope you have a fun rest of your week at Vacation Bible School, what? and I'll see you around. What's your favorite part about Vacation Bible School? Um, I like playing outside on stuff. Playing outside on stuff. We all do. <laughs> all right. I'm Zebediah from Israeli News Team B, and I'm probably going to go play in this pyramid right here. It looks pretty cool. Woo! Pyramid! Woo!